Hey guys, I got a bit of a different video for you today. As it turns out, my neighbor actually works for this really cool company called Accelerated Systems Incorporated. And what they do is they actually build electronic speed controllers and motors for electric vehicle applications. And what that means is every once in a while, they have to test their motors. So they actually found this go-kart on Craigslist, threw their motor and speed controller on, and we supplied some lithium polymer batteries from our flight project. And now, we're gonna take it for a rip. That was sweet. Ready? All right. In case you're wondering how we got so much power out of this little go-kart, it's all because of this little electric power pack. This is a 11 kilowatt peak or 15 horsepower DC brushless motor, complete with an electronic speed controller with Bluetooth. Now the neat thing with electric motors is they provide almost instantaneous torque. This guy will put out 54 foot pounds of torque almost right away, as opposed to a gas engine where you're going to need to hit that red line, that sweet spot with the RPM to give you that much power. Now because of that, that allows us to do wheelies no problem from the get-go. In fact, this 15 horsepower electric motor could outperform any 15 horsepower gas engine. <laughs> and that's how you brake. So bad news, I forgot to turn the GoPro on. How are these batteries not dead yet? <laughs> ah, error code. So that was a lot of fun. As you saw, the electric motor has crazy torque. This thing does wheelies on pavement, no problem. Has awesome acceleration. The only problem is the steering sucks. There's no suspension. My back's sore because of this plastic seat. And there's no seat belt. So we're thinking we can upgrade this a bit. And by upgrade, I mean completely get rid of this chassis and go with something a bit better. So we found this frame on Craigslist for about 500 bucks, and it, it's actually a competition Baja built by a university engineering team. So that means it's ultra lightweight, it's got independent suspension, front and rear disc brakes, and I think it's got a lot more potential than that little go-kart does. We're probably even going to have to build a wheelie bar off the back. So if you're interested in seeing how this project turns out, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're really excited to get this thing on the road. It's going to take a bit of work though. Out, 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 out. Hey guys, we've got a bit of a different video for you today. As it 
God damn it, Ian. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> <laughs>